Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, welcome. So today we are actually gonna be doing finally another dollar store haul. I'm so excited. You guys seem to really enjoy these videos and I love filming them. And I am definitely a dollar store fanatic, so let's get right into it. Okay, I think I'm gonna start out with the candles first because honestly, Dollarama has really stepped up their game when it comes to candles, you guys. So the first one I picked up is the Watson's Candles Amber and Bergamot candle. And this is so freaking cute. It's like a little tiny kind of mason jar style and I think it's so adorable. But oh my gosh, you guys, it smells so amazing. Like it's definitely a stronger scent. It kind of reminds me of like fresh laundry or kind of cologne, I guess, like a little bit of cologne, nothing like too crazy, but I absolutely love this candle. And then we went ahead and we got the pumpkin apple version. So it's the same brand um, and same style, but pumpkin apple. And of course had to pick it up, it's fall. This one smells so good as well, you guys. It's definitely that like traditional pumpkin smell. It also smells like, you know, those um, scented pine cones you can get sometimes. It reminds me of that as well. So if you like those, you'll definitely like this candle, but Mm, just gives me the fall vibes, you know? And both of these candles were $1.50 each. I think that's a pretty good deal. And also these both have amazing throw to them. As soon as you light these, you smell them right away. I think for a small candle, these are really worth it. Okay, I have one more candle here to show you guys. This is by the same brand, so Watson's Candles. This is what it looks like. Again, kind of like that mason jar style. And this one is in the scent Lemon, but honestly, we just use it as decoration. So haven't lit this one yet, but it does smell really, really nice. It's very fresh, definitely a very strong lemon scent, but but I really like this Watson's Candle brand. I think they're really nice. This one was also $1.50 as well, so I think that's a pretty good deal. It is a little bit smaller than these, I believe. Actually, it might not be. I don't know, it looks a little bit smaller, but honestly, it might not be because you do get quite a bit of candle in here. This one is a little bit shorter, but it's wider, so it might actually be like the same amount. I'm not sure. Okay, so we'll move on to this one next. This is honestly probably one of my favorite purchases from the dollar store ever. So this is the Garnier Whole Blends Gentle Detangling Milk. This is seriously amazing. If you have like curly kind of naughty hair, which I do, obviously mine's straightened right now and kind of styled, but my natural hair is kind of curly and very dry, very tangly. This is perfect for you guys. I will spray this into brushed hair, um, but when I get out of the shower, obviously, so I'll spray it in my hair and then I'll go in with a detangling comb afterwards. And it is seriously amazing, you guys. I swear, if you see this at the dollar store, please pick it up. You will love it. It also smells, it smells so good, you guys, so good. This was probably, around... this was probably $4. I'm not seeing a price tag, but for Garnier, I think that's a pretty good deal. So absolutely love this. Next, we'll just go into another hair product because I think this is the only one I have left. So this is the Euro Salon Dry Shampoo and it's in the unscented version. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I do not like this product at all. I needed a new dry shampoo at the time, so I picked this one up. It is a pretty big um, bottle. So I was like, you know what? I'll go with this one, I'll try it out. Usually I use the Batiste one, but they didn't have any at the time. So I picked this guy up and I was like, let's give it a go, let's see what it's like but honestly it's not good it smells terrible <laughs> like it says unscented but it has the most awful chemical smell i've ever smelled my entire life i do not like it at all it's very very strong and i just don't find that it works very well at all for a dry shampoo this is probably one of the worst ones i've ever tried and i mean it was four dollars so i think that's pretty pricey and i just I don't know, I did not like this product at all. If it works for you guys, that's awesome, but it just did not work out for me, so I don't recommend this guy. Okay, moving on, we'll go to this guy right here. So this is the water bottle that I've been using constantly. I absolutely love this. This is by the brand Igloo, and I looked these up on, I don't know if it was Amazon or Walmart, one of the two, but I think they were around like $15.99 regular price, and I believe, I believe these were $4 at the dollar store, so I think that's an awesome deal. It's very good quality, very thick. Um, it doesn't come with the straw, but these straws are actually from the dollar store anyway. I drink out of this thing every single day. I absolutely love it, and it's just a savior when it comes to me getting like my water intake. This guy right here saves a day. Let's move on to some kitchen appliances. Why not? So we got these little, they're actually a set of three. They're these glasses. The other two are in the dishwasher right now, so they have one to show you, but they're just these really pretty um, clear glasses. I really like them. They're very, very lightweight. They're pretty thick when it comes to the bottom of these, but 
The top is very, very thin, so I'd probably be a little bit careful with these guys. Um, I think if you just hit it off of something, it'd probably break right away, but I really like these. I think they're very like aesthetically pleasing, and like I said, pack of three, I think they were $2 or $2.50, something like that, so pretty good deal. I was looking for the double walled glasses. Those have been everywhere lately, super trendy, but I couldn't find any. I know I've seen them there before, so gonna have to keep looking but um, I really like these and they're perfect for just like an everyday kind of drinking glass. Okay next we're gonna move on to this little spatula right here. Spatula? Spatula? What is wrong with me? This is not a spatula. <laughs> next we're gonna move on to this little whisk right here. If you do a lot of baking and cooking you're gonna want one of these. So it's the silicone whisk with the little plastic handle. The best thing about this is it's not going to scratch anything. I know I use a lot of stainless steel when I cook um, especially with bowls so I'm always like oh I don't want to scratch it with a regular spoon or you know any kind of utensil so this guy right here comes in handy so much. It works perfectly. It's just a gray silicone. I'm not seeing a brand name on this anywhere and I don't remember how much this was but I want to say it was probably around 250 maybe three bucks. Okay speaking of mixing bowls let's move on to this one right here. So this is a humongous mixing bowl that I got. This was four bucks but it is super super thick nice glass bowl. This is honestly such great quality you guys like I'm very very impressed with it. I use it all the time. It's perfect for baking and it's super big too like Look at that. So I think this is the last kitchen product that I have. So this is a little measure equivalence magnet. So you can go ahead and stick this on your fridge and it's awesome, especially if you, like I said, you do bake and cook a lot. This is gonna be perfect for you. So if you were looking for, you know, the equivalent for one cup to tablespoons, so it says one cup is equal to 16 tablespoons. Unfortunately, I don't think the camera's gonna pick it up. Also, if you see fingerprints on it, I'm sorry. <laughs> it is that type of material that picks up all the fingerprints. I really wish you guys could see it clearer, but basically it has cup measurements, it has tablespoons, teaspoons, ounces, and milliliters. So I think that's really awesome. It's definitely a neat product to have. Like I said, you can just go ahead, stick it right on your fridge because it is magnet. If you didn't want to use it as a magnet, you can just kind of keep it in your cupboard, any place like that. All right, next, kind of a boring product, but I picked up a pill organizer. I don't even really know what these are called, but I just use these for my vitamins. They're perfect. They really remind me to actually take my vitamins. I'll go ahead and I'll put this on my makeup desk and I'm just like, okay, Monday, here we go. And I'll, you know, take my vitamins. Like I said, kind of a boring product but I do think it's a very useful one. It has all of the AM um, dates down here and then in the blue is all the PM. Next I picked up this little notepad and it says things to do and then you have all the dates. So basically you can go ahead and kind of plan out your days and this is really awesome. This has come in handy for me so much. I use it every single day and basically what you do when you're done with that week you go ahead and you rip the sheet off. So it is perfect if you guys want something that's a little bit more compact because I know a lot of the like planner calendars are huge but I wanted something I could fit kind of more so on my desk but write everything that I needed down on and this is absolutely perfect. It also is super super cute you guys. Look at that. Definitely again a very useful product and also definitely one of my favorite products for sure. Speaking of planners, I got this ginormous one and this is a weekly planner. It has goals on it, to do, notes, and then you have the days of the week right here and it also comes with a dry erase marker right there. So this is super super cool you guys. They also had it in the black frame if you didn't want the wood. I feel like this is a home sense product. Like this doesn't even look like you got it from the dollar store. You know what I mean? And it does have this kind of backing on it right there so you can go ahead and hang it up. I think this would be perfect like just to hang in your kitchen or any spot like that. But I thought this was so cool. I think it's such a neat product. And I believe this was $4, but I think it's definitely worth four bucks for sure. Like I said, you can go ahead and pick something like this up at home sense for probably 15 bucks. So to go ahead and get it at the dollar store for four, crazy. I think I moved my camera. We only have a few products left here, so let's go ahead with this guy next. So this is a fabric shaver, I believe is what they're called. So basically how this works is, say you had a pair of sweatpants and they might be fraying somewhere and like the fabric's getting a little bit, you know, kind of fraying off, whatever. You go ahead, you take this, turn it on. I was like that's very loud and then you go against the sweatpants like that you could even use it on a blanket anything that has like extra like fraying fabric it gets rid of it so perfectly with lint or anything that's like stuck on the fabric gone this thing is so neat so handy I love it 
I use it all the time, especially on like blankets. And then to clean it, you just go ahead, take this part off and dump out whatever came off. I actually have a little bit of lint in there right now. And this does require, I think it's two AAA batteries and it doesn't come with the product, so you have to buy that separately. But I think this is such a neat product. I really recommend picking this up. Next, kind of a random one, but I needed a new deodorant. So I was like, I'm gonna hit up the dollar store, see what they have there. And I saw this one here. I really like the brand Lady Speed Stick. And this one is actually in the scent Peony and French Vanilla. And oh my goodness, you guys. It smells amazing. Like this is seriously the best smelling deodorant I've ever had in my entire life. Like it smells so freaking good. It's definitely a stronger scent. Like it's very perfumey, but I absolutely love it. It is also invisible. Those are my favorite kind. But if you guys see this deodorant, please go pick it up. It is awesome. Okay, speaking of deodorant, I picked up these Spa Scriptions Active Essentials Women's Deodorant Wipes. I haven't used these yet, but I've been hearing a lot of great things about them. And basically they're kind of like a on the go deodorant wipe. So you can use these on your, where does it say? Apply it to your neck, back, chest, and underarms as needed. I think these would be perfect in the summertime just to throw in your purse. If you need to freshen up, just take a wipe out. There you go. They're $1.50 for 25 wipes. Okay, and this is my last product here. So this is a little like eye cooling mask. So basically what you do with this is you put it on like this, obviously, but first you go ahead and you put it in the refrigerator. So get it nice and cool, nice and chill, and then put it on your eyes. And it is seriously the most relaxing thing ever, you guys. I love this. If you are somebody that gets headaches a lot of time, I think this is gonna be perfect for you, especially if you get like headaches right around here. It does also have an adjustable strap there so you can get it nice and fitted to your head. I absolutely love this and I definitely recommend it. All right, guys, so that was everything in my dollar store haul. This one was a little bit smaller than the ones that I usually do. I usually do a ginormous one, but I've been trying to cut back a little bit on my dollar store spending because I can go into the dollar store and spend like 50 bucks in one go. The dollar store just has my heart, you guys. <laughs> but anyways, I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big like and subscribe because I would really appreciate that. Also, don't forget to go check me out on my Instagram. It is always linked down below. Anyways, I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.